Wakey, wakey. Anybody home? Ah, there you are. <laughs> oh, calm down. Don't look so scared. I already injected you with this. It's an antidote. You'd be happy to know. I jabbed you with a sedative back at the opera. Yeah. <laughs> I was disguised as an usher. Surprised you didn't notice, but I suppose that aria was pretty breathtaking. Put anybody into a daze. <laughs> now, if I take the tape off your mouth, will you scream? <laughs> I'm just kidding. There's no one around to hear you scream. I'm going to take it off, because I do love our repartee. What was that? Oh, I think you're going to regret calling me that. Oh, I have missed this. It's been a while since I last had you tied up. <clears throat> oh, good times. Good times, but I believe you know why you're here. Where's the drive? No. Of course, I knew you wouldn't give it up that easy, but I have to ask. So, Here's what's gonna happen. You're gonna tell me where the drive is, and I'm going to go and see if you're telling the truth. And if you are, I'll come back, and I'll let you go. And if you're not, I'll kill you. Yeah, I suppose I could take the information and just leave you here, but you would die either way, so... The choice is really up to you. <sighs> I have missed this. Oh, it's been a while. I do love our game of cat and mouse. <clears throat> oh, I think you love it as much as I do. You know, after you gave me the slip back in Monaco, when I took all of your chips in blackjack, I swore, I swore that I would get you back for that. And here we are. <clears throat> Why do I need to drive? Are you kidding? I mean... Money? <laughs> you know what it's worth. <laughs> and, uh... My boss has promised to pay me royally for it. So... Oh, please. A girl can always use more money. In Geneva last. I picked up a little souvenir. Yeah, 
pass after I stopped at the bank, he got me one of these. Cliché, maybe, but I do love the versatility. You know, you have your generic knife. It's very useful. It comes in handy, as you know. And there's always things we need to cut ourselves out of. I'm sure you wouldn't mind having this for your ropes. Yes? Hmm. Mm -hmm. And they're so sharp. Yeah? Hmm. You do have such a beautiful face. It would be a shame to mar that beauty. Now what else? Bottle opener. It's always handy. You must be thirsty. Would you like a beer? <clears throat> I'm just kidding. Now this, this has a much different purpose. <sighs> you know, I think my favorite would be the corkscrew. You remember Paris? A bottle of wine on the Seine? Hmm. Another use. It's just right into the eye socket. And you can just pop the eyes right out. <laughs> it's really a wonder, isn't it? Swiss are such clever people. Hmm, I do love your eyes. But I could keep them in a jar. On my shelf, you know? That would be a lovely prize. <laughs> and you don't need your eyes to tell me where the drive is. So, one more time, sweetheart. Where's the drive? <sighs> you know, <laughs> I can't say I'm disappointed that you won't tell me. It gives me an excuse to keep playing. <laughs> You know, I think we should stick with the classics. And you can't go wrong. With a little knife. So, I was thinking, you would look great with a little Van Gogh look, don't you think? All the ladies love it. Oh, so I've been told. It'll make you look quite rugged, dangerous. I'd be doing you a favor, really. Shall we? Um, I can take one, then you'll still be able to hear me when I ask you again where the drive is. Hmm. You are so cute when you lie. You are really sweet. Don't 
adorable. <laughs> mm. But I know better. You are sneaky, sneaky, sneaky little spy. And you're gonna pay. Yeah. You are. Okay. So, where should we start first? Your choice. No. No, I don't think so. Here are the options. Eye, eye, nose, ear, ear. I would like one. Okay, just start with one. I think that's a very fair bargain. Okay. If you will not make the choice, then I will make the choice for you. I think we'll start with the left ear. Yeah, okay. And, oh, hush, will you? It's not that bad. Okay. Okay, I'll stop. I'm happy to stop. <clears throat> as long as you tell me where the drive is. Look. I'll get the drive, I'll make the drop off, and then I'll be hanging on a beach in Fiji somewhere, and you can do whatever you want, I really don't care. who loves to have a boss, but I go where the money goes. And no matter who my boss is, you know that I always come out on top. watch for a while, but I think it might get boring. <sighs> I'm honestly getting kind of bored right now. Can you just... You don't make any fun noises when I poke you. this. You tell me where the drive is. And I will take you with me to Fiji. And when your boss's men come to get their revenge on you, I might defend you. Oh, please, I can take those goons any day. You know I can. Remember Rio? Those were good times. I know. I think we should go back to it, partners. Well, you have a different definition of partners than I do. That's the fun. You never know when the double cross is coming. It keeps you on your toes. It keeps life interesting. <sighs> you can be so uptight sometimes with your ideas of honor. I mean, none of that even exists. If it ever did, it's long gone. All that matters is power and who wields it. And 
I never want to be on the other side of a knife. Here you are, and here I am. You know, so you should probably recognize the fact that you're in no position to negotiate. True. If I don't get the drive, he'll probably attempt to kill me, but <laughs> I manage to slip away every time. You know. You remember. Oh, don't pretend like you don't love it. <sighs> you know, I do have some other concoctions. You could play with those. I can make you see nightmares. I can make you forget what's real. Oh, I can make you think that I'm your savior. Wouldn't that be fun? <sighs> there are so, so many games that we could play. You know, if I'm being honest, I wish we had more time. I could do this for days, weeks. I mean, I could keep you here for months. Yeah, but time is of the essence. So, what'll it be? Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, you know you're gonna tell me. You know you can't resist. How about this? <laughs> Instead of threatening, I offer a reward. <clears throat> you tell me where the drive is. I bring you to Fiji. Protect you. We spend our days sipping my ties on the beach. Spend our nights rolling in piles of money. It'll be just like old times. You miss it. I know you do. I see that hesitation in your eyes. Little traitorous piece of you that still wants a piece of me. <laughs> what do you say? How about this? No more bosses. No more bosses. We take the drive. We self-drive. We don't have to go fetch for anyone. We work together. A team. 50-50. Split the profits. <laughs> Encryption, please. It's nothing to me, you know that. I have those skills. You have your skills. Together. Unstoppable. 
Clever. Very clever. Untie you? Oh, honey. First, I have to make sure you're not lying to me, so... I think it's time for another little nap. you were telling the truth. If not, well then, sorry. But I think I believe you. And I think this is going to be the start of something beautiful. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 